Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Sage 50 Intelligence Reporting provides additional reporting that uses Excel 2007 or later to show company information. Licenses for Sage 50 Intelligence Reporting are specific to each user and each computer. You receive one license with a subscription to Sage 50 Intelligence Reporting, although you can purchase more as needed. You also receive a free 60-day trial of the service with all Sage 50 versions. Users who have an existing Sage Business Care Plan already have an existing one-user license. If you need your activation information, contact a Sage Customer Support Specialist for your activation information. To enable Sage 50 Intelligence Reporting, select Reports and Forms, Intelligence Reporting Setup, Activation Manager from the menu bar. To start your Intelligence Reporting trial, click the Yes button in the lower right corner of the Sage 50 Intelligence Reporting window that opens. If needed, enter your activation code in the Activation Code field of the next window that opens and click the Activate Now button to continue. However, if using Sage 50 2017 or later, the product should automatically activate itself. Simply close this window and then select Reports and Forms, Intelligence Reporting Setup, Report Manager from the menu bar. In the dialog box that then appears, you can install the newer version of Sage Intelligence Reporting if needed. After that completes, click the OK button. The Sage 50 Intelligence Reporting should then be available. You can then close the Report Manager window that opens. To create a standard Sage 50 Intelligence Report, select Reports and Forms, Intelligence Reporting from the menu bar to open the Intelligence Reporting section of the Reports tab within the Select a Report or Form window. Then click the folder icon to the right for the Intelligence Report category to view. The reports within the selected category then appear. To open a Sage 50 Intelligence Report in Excel, double-click it or click it to select it, and then click the Display button in the Windows toolbar. Then enter any parameters required by the report into the fields within any dialog boxes that appear. After entering any desired parameters, click the OK button to open the report in Excel. After the report opens in Excel, you can click the Worksheet tab names at the bottom of the window to view the report data as well as instructions and additional help on using the report. You can modify the report in Excel and it doesn't affect the report template saved within Sage 50. When you are finished using the report in Excel, you can close it. Be sure to save any changes you want to keep. By default, the reports are saved to your computer's documents folder. Note that after a report is created, you can open it again in Excel and do not need to run it from Sage 50 each time. You will not need to create a new version of the report unless you want to change or update the parameters within the report. In that case, you can simply create another version of the report from Sage 50 again. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.